My name is Jeff Schroeder, and I primarily play guitar for the Smashing Pumpkins, but before that, I was in a band called the Lassie Foundation. Yeah. So here, classic Lassie Foundation vinyl LP of our album Pacifico, but it really felt, that was like that time you're like, wow, actually, I never thought, you know, in 1999, I'd have an album, like an LP. Sure. You know, when you asked me to you know, maybe collaborate on this film, you know, I started thinking about a bunch of different things about what the film kind of meant thematically, and so I started kind of just meditating on that, and what I wanted to do is now that I'm at a different point in my life is kind of do a revisiting of some of the things that have, musical things that have been important to me. You know, this is actually the first record I ever bought. I still have it. My brother's friend worked at a Kmart. They sold records there and my brother's friend worked and he was like, if you guys come in, I'll give you a discount. I spent, I was there for like two hours, like looking and I was like, okay, now that I'm kind of at a different crossroads personally of like where I'm going to go um, later in my life, you know, in the future, I felt like th this movie and like what it's about was an opportune time to look at those things and kind of look at this stuff from a musical vantage point. Actually, this is this is new. I always wanted one of these, and I think this is going to show up on the soundtrack a lot. Oh, wow. This wow. is. Uh, a Rockman soloist. Tom Schultz. <laughs> Tom Schultz from Boston. Oh my god. Headphone amp. I had to take out a small loan to uh, buy the batteries required to get this thing fired up. It takes eight AA batteries and there's no um, place for an adapter. I mean, I think this is you know a short version of the story is that maybe look at your bunch of young people, you get together, you write some music, but you're working with the context of what your friends are into, what the clerk at the record store is into, what's being played on the radio, what you're reading about or on the internet or listening on the internet, all those types of things. And then, if, um, so you're really embedded in that. You need your friends to help you get to the gig, set up the gig. I mean, it's very, community is very integral. Yeah, sometimes you wish like, you could have had the perspective of experience back then, but that's what makes being innocent so wonderful too, and just not knowing. <laughs>